Hi guys, it's the middle of the night, and I'm on Tumblr, as we kind of all are, a lot, and I am just so sad and disturbed about this Ferguson um, situation that's going on now. I'm furious. Furious. And it's, it's, it has nothing really to do with that. Oh, like, it, it has to do with that situation. But it's not just that situation. It's much, much more. I just look fabulous. But I had to, I had to speak. Um, I think it's, it's absolutely horrible. That as a 17 year old girl, I have to see this happening that one of my main concerns is that people are getting shot at it is sad it is sad and i'm not just i'm not just talking about this ferguson incident it was a horrible incident i really wish it didn't happen it's horrible that it happened it sucks that it happened because an innocent kid an innocent boy lost his life because people are stupid i mean that that's that's what racism is racism is to me it's so stupid and the people who believe in it are so extreme at it that it just it breaks your heart to see it because i <laughs> It's just, it's hard to look at this and, and see a life be taken away because of ignorance and, and superiority that some whites think that we have. We have no superiority. You, it's horrible. And personally, me, I've grown up around so many different races. I mean, like... My town is small, and the next town over has, I mean, it has a lot of people. It, it has a lot of different races. It's not just white people. I understand, like, the white people just, just look crazy sometimes. <laughs> but I feel like this world is, like, splitting us apart by race. That really sucks because that shouldn't be the case. I mean, I look around and some of my best friends are black. And I would be devastated to hear that they were, like, arrested for being who they are, being questioned because of their skin color. You shouldn't be questioned just because you have a darker skin color than someone else. That's sad and disappointing and degrading, and I hate it. I honestly can go on and on about how much I hate this world. As beautiful as some of it is, there's just so much hatred and so much violence that it just overshadows the beauty. I mean, I just, I feel so consumed by this. Why do I have to be consumed by this? This is horrible why does this have to happen in our world why does our world have to be so screwed up and so split it's honestly it makes me want to cry i honestly am a very very sensitive person when it comes to that and it gets me very angry and it gets me very 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 sad this event that is happening shouldn't even be happening these are peaceful protesters they have done nothing but peacefully protest a stupid policeman's thing the fact that he was unarmed first of all that's that's wrong don't shoot I'm pretty sure there's a law that you can't shoot someone unless they have a weapon that they're using against you. And from what I'm hearing, he didn't have a weapon. 
And from what I'm reading, that town is very segregated. That whole area is very segregated. It's like St. Louis is the 10th segregated place in the country as of 2010. I don't know. I just feel like this world is evolving into something beautiful. But at the same time, we are tearing each other down. And we are shooting innocent people. And it's heartbreaking. It's very, very heartbreaking. I don't want to hear that. I honestly could not, I, I could not stand seeing someone die because they're who they are. Like, I would be devastated if that happened to my best friend. I don't want that to happen to anyone. No one deserves that. Oh, just because he's black, you're really going to use that as an excuse. I mean, people are being arrested. It's sad that we live in a world where kids have to hear about horrible racism. Horrible... Just everything. And... I'm not saying that that hasn't happened before. Like, honestly, racism has been a problem for hundreds of years. I mean, it's been around forever. But now, it's so easily accessible for someone to go online and find that. Headline news on your home page is that somebody got killed and now they're protesting. Now, they're being ridiculous, bringing in the tanks and the guns and the canines. What threat is there? They're pissed off. They're hurt. They're sad because you just killed an innocent boy who is unarmed because he started running away from you because he's scared. Because you scared him. Because you shot him. <sighs> and sometimes I really am ashamed to be a part of this generation because it just makes me sad. It also makes me sad to think of the older generation who I respect completely, but they're being as horribly racist as everyone else. We are so we are we are such an amazing amazing world. And we are just falling apart at the seams and it is sad because it is beautiful this is a beautiful world to live in there's some beautiful things but I can't look past this because I can't go on a social media site without someone talking about it I've had to close my tumblr three times because I couldn't stand it any longer I'm not saying that my opinion is right. I'm not saying that I'm, I have the right mindset or that like everyone else is wrong. Everyone has their own opinion. Totally fine about it. But this is mine. Mine is we are screwing up big time. So in Ferguson, they need to put down the guns. They need to stop throwing tear gas. They just need to stop. Because this is not a world that I want to bring another generation into. Because it is, as I've been saying this entire video, it's so beautiful, but it's so corrupted and so messed up. And it's been this way forever. There's always going to be corruption. There's always going to be problems. But it's just escalated on a scale where it's so easy to find it. And it just breaks my heart. I really wish that I could be in the dark about this situation because it's terrifying and it's scary. And I can't imagine the pain that the families are going through right now for the people who I've lost their lives these past couple of, I'd say like a day or two. It's devastating. 
it's like two in the morning here and I, I had to get my opinion down. I just had to talk about it because it is just it's so sad that this is the world that we live in. This beautiful world and why are we wasting it? Why are we turning guns on each other? Why? This is not who we are. We are human beings. We shouldn't be doing this to each other. Because we're all equal. We're all beautiful in our own way. And... Because some people are just so in their own world, they forget about others. It's just heartbreaking to see a young man lose his life. It's always hard to see that. I hate the news, I hate turning that on because I hate seeing young people and just people in general whose time has not come get killed because of ignorance and stupidity. Honestly, I think we need world peace. And I'm not just saying that, like, it, it's something that we need to work on. It's never going to be perfect. But where we are standing now and what has been going on in the world is absolutely saddening. And I am scared to grow up in this this world sometimes and I shouldn't have to be I just I want to enjoy life I want to live just a happy life and sometimes you just see these things on the news and they put you down and it's heartbreaking and I wish I have my deepest s sympathy to the, the families that have lost people. And I hope the silent protesters stay safe and just, just, you're standing up for something good. Because I'm telling you. That 17-year-old boy did not deserve to die the way that he did. I'm going to stop talking before I start crying again. So, I will see you another day on a happier note. Yeah. Bye.